welcome to quick learning guys today we will learn a very special transaction of SAP PM module that is IW37 which is used to change operations of different maintenance orders at a time to start this transaction we will press IW37 in our transaction tab we will press enter and you will see this window will appear in front of you to get the different orders as per your requirement we have these criteria available we can put our required information in these and then we will get the desired work orders accordingly the first one is the work center if you have the work center of any plant or any area you will put the work center here other is the plant where these the equipment function locations are located next one is or the orders itself if you have the name the number of the orders you can put it there order types if you want to see some particular orders for example it's pm01 or pm02 then what it you will just write the order type here you can see these are all the available order types for example we have unplanned maintenance orders or planned maintenance orders we can just select any one of these here other is the reference data the activity operation short text if you want to get the list of orders based upon your short text you will just write here then function location equipment number material for example if you want to search the all the uh, orders that have been created for a particular material code you will just search it from there the those list of orders will be appeared in front of you planner group planning plant and etc the other one going down are the related to time if you have the start date finish date actual start date actual finish date etc so you can also get the desired information from this uh, uh, categories as well so now uh, let's have some examples in the operation we have selected the current orders we are not selecting the historical because the historical ones are those which have already been completed so uh, here uh, let's have an example i want to search the pm01 type orders that are for unplanned maintenance for this particular function location i know this is the part that function location is and i want to select for this particular equipment these orders so i have three major inputs that i have put in these uh, tabs i will press execute button and you will see that a list of orders will appear in front of you so for these three criteria only two orders are available in system the first one is the this one with this operation and the other one is the second second one you can open any one of these for example i open the first one and this order will be displayed uh, in your window with this title the all the informations are available here and its components are there and you can see this order is technically completed so you cannot made change in this specific order so any technically completed order cannot be further you know uh, changed or anything else so going down i will see the next order this is the next one you can see this is not technically completed so you know all the data in it is just editable Here, this is the operations tab this is the components tab you can add or remove any component as per your need so you see that uh, we have uh, a list of orders available with us <clears throat> and we can perform any change in these based upon these parameters or categories we can just change any one of these for example i change order type to pm02 i keep the rest of these two as it is i press execute button and now you will see a different type of orders will appear so here you see these three orders have appeared and all of these are these are the same orders and these are for planned maintenance for cleaning the cabinets 
for checking the dates of CPU batteries, for checking CO2 filters, etc. So these orders are what? These orders are planned orders. So these have appeared in front of you. You can open any one of these and you can get your required change done. Similarly, uh, let's see, I remove this equipment. I keep the order type to PM01 and I just execute, you know, I have made some changes now. We will see what happens, what type of orders appear. So a complete list of orders have appeared. All of these are PM01 and all of these are for this particular functional location. For the, all the equipments on that function location, the orders are here. So you can see these orders have appeared. All these, you can make any change in these as per your need. Okay. So you have seen that we are able to uh, get our desired orders in our single tabular form using this data. So I have this video have been, has been very much useful for all of you. For any questions, you can just write in comments tab. Please like and share this video and subscribe to our channel. Please do watch our other videos which are also very helpful for your daily usage in SCP. Until next time, bye-bye.